If you don't believe that there's one best mattress for everyone, you might want to take a look at Helix. They're going to customize a mattress to you based on your needs and preferences. But is it going to be any good? Stay tuned to find out. First things first, if you have any specific questions or you want me to give you a personal recommendation, I'm happy to do so. All you have to do is leave a comment below and leave me some information about yourself. So Helix doesn't believe that there's one best mattress for everyone. Now they have nine different mattress models. You, you can either see what those are and select one, or you can fill out a sleep quiz, fill out some information about yourself, what your needs and preferences are, and they'll, they'll give you a mattress that's fit for you. So this is actually the Midnight model. It's their most popular model. It's a medium feel. Um, it's good for good pressure relief for side sleepers, but good for people to switch all positions at night, which kind of fits me. So I was excited to jump in and give it a try. Let's talk about the construction of the Midnight Helix mattress. So we've got a cover here. There's actually two covers. And what you can do, they have something called an ultra cool cover, which you have to pay extra for, but it has this phase change material in it, which can help regulate temperatures. So if you're worried about sleeping hot, that's something you might want to consider. Moving on to the mattress now, we have 10 inches in total. We have a base layer for the coils to rest on. And the whole concept here is basically, it's a hybrid kind of concept where you get support coming from these coils and then good pressure relief from this memory foam. So this is a medium feel that's gonna be good for side sleepers and potentially people who switch positions at night, which is kind of what I do, I mainly sleep on my side. So you get good pressure relief from this memory foam. It's a very soft material, pretty slow moving memory foam. If you stick around later, we do a pressure map test that shows exactly how well this mattress leaves pressure. We have six inches of support coils. So if you're sleeping on your back, it's gonna allow your hips to sink in, then the coils are gonna kind of keep you up, so it should be supportive on your back and stomach, and good pressure relief on your side. So breathability, if you just see there's so much air that can flow through these coils, plus if you add that ultra cool cover, it should be very good at not sleeping hot. So we have a transition layer here, but kind of the main components are the memory foam for pressure relief, and the support comes from the coils, and that's construction overall. Let's talk about firmness and feel. As far as firmness is concerned, they say this is a medium feel, and I'm gonna put it about a six and a half out of 10, so I definitely agree with that. Uh, the reason is the top two inches are memory foam, very soft, then there's a transition layer, a little bit firmer, then very firm support coils underneath that. So depending on how heavy you are, you may press through that top layer more easily, so you might feel a little bit more firmness, or if you're a little bit lighter than I am, you might think it's a little bit softer, but I'm gonna go with six and a half out of 10. As far as feel is concerned, you'll see that there's basically no bounce whatsoever, just given that there's memory foam on top, but it's only two inches of memory foam, so you're not gonna get too much of that true quick sandy memory foam feel. It's gonna be pretty easy to move around, so it's kind of a balanced feel overall. You can feel the coils a little bit. I was pretty very supportive feel overall, but I would just say a balanced feel overall. I'm gonna talk through how I feel in different sleeping positions, and this is a medium feel mattress, the Midnight model, so it's gonna be a pretty good fit for all three sleeping positions. So starting on my back, I can feel that the memory foam is kind of conforming to the curves of my body, but the coils are really kind of holding me up, so I feel this is a very good match for me from a support perspective on my back. Switching to my side, I can feel the memory foam kind of kicking in. I don't really feel too much pressure at all, so I feel like it's a pretty good match on my side as well. And then switching onto my stomach, I feel like, again, it's a pretty good match for me. Uh, I think if I just slept on my stomach, stomach, I'd maybe want something a little bit firmer, but overall I feel like pretty, pretty nice uh, support in this position. I'm going to give you a visual representation of where you might feel pressure points on this mattress. I've got a pressure map here. I'm going to lie down on my backside and stomach. You're going to see anywhere from blue to no pressure all the way up to red to high pressure. The only thing to note is that this is the Helix Midnight mattress. It's got a medium feel to it. And if you have a different body type than I do, you might see different results, but let's get started. Hey guys, Martin here to offer a different perspective. Joe's 5'9", 160. I'm 6'7", 230. I have a different body type. I want to give my experience with this mattress. So today we have the Helix Midnight. Joe said this was a 6.5 out of 10 for firmness. I said it was closer to a 7 out of 10 for firmness. And I think that's mostly because I'm a little bit larger person. I'm pressing the comfort layer and I'm feeling the transition layers and the firmer layers beneath that. So in terms of sleeping positions, starting on my back, feel nice overall support, hip sinking a little bit, but I feel that foam kind of pressing into my lumbar area. I feel really nice support overall. Moving to my side, I feel a little bit of pressure on my shoulders and my hips, but not too much. 
Moving around on my stomach, I do feel properly supported there as well. I don't feel my hips sinking in too far and getting me out of alignment. So if you are a larger person like me and you sleep on your back, side, or stomach, you might actually find a good balance here. If you're a combination sleeper, for instance, this could work for you as well. However, um, if you are even larger than me, I would also consider the Helix Nightfall, which is made specifically for larger people. So we get a lot of questions from people who sleep with a partner. They want to know if their partner's moving around that side of the bed. Is that motion going to be isolated or is it going to transfer over to them and possibly wake them up at night? Call that motion transfer. Test that. I have a glass here. I'm going to kind of roll around, see how this glass reacts. You can see it's not moving too much. Create a little disturbance here with my hands. See it's not moving that much. We've got memory foam on top, so I expected this to do pretty well. I also had Martin on my team just kind of jump in and out of bed really quick. Didn't really feel that motion transfer over to me, so I feel like it does well with this and it's a good option for couples. If you sleep with a partner or you like sleeping towards the very edge of the bed, you may want to consider something we call edge support. Now we've got a mattress here where the foam is collapsing a little bit, but the coils are kind of preventing me from getting that like kind of falling off the bed feeling. But I'm going to switch onto my back here go towards the edge. I don't really feel like I'm going to fall off the bed or anything like that, so I feel like the edge support in this case is pretty good. Oh, let's talk about the pros of this mattress, and it's really just one very large pro. So what I wanted to do with this is basically see if they have all these customization options, do they actually do what they say they're going to do and find a good fit for you? So I got the midnight model and it was just a very good fit for me. It felt very nice on my side, but it was still very supportive because I tend to switch positions at night, but mainly sleep on my side. So it felt great on my side, but also very supportive on my stomach and back. And just looking at all the different models, they're really going to hit all the different types of sleepers. If you're worried about sleeping cool, they can kind of match something to that. They also have this ultra cool cover, which can kind of add temperature regulation. So they have a big person mattress. So I think they've really done a good job of addressing any type of sleeper that can actually find a good fit for you. Let's talk through some potential cons or who I think this mattress may not be the best fit for. And it's really just one big thing to note. There are only certain materials that are in any of the combinations. There's certain materials like latex that are not in the mattress. Um, you can only get a little bit of memory foam, but if you want like a true four inches of memory foam, true memory foam feel, you're not going to be able to get that with this mattress. So there's certain types of feels that are just not going to be possible just given the material kind of limitations that they have. So I really like the mattress. It's going to be a great fit for a lot of people, but if you have specific types of feels with certain types of materials that they don't have, you're not going to be able to find that with this mattress. Wanted to give you some additional information about Helix. They have a bunch of cool accessories available. Uh, I think the coolest one is actually this ultra cool cover. You can see it here. It has phase change material in it, which can allow for extra temperature regulation. So if you're worried about sleeping hot, this can be a great option for you. All you have to do is just basically replace the top cover and, and put this back on. So you have a sleep quiz option. You can basically just fill out inf information about yourself and they'll give you a mattress for you. Or you can just hand select one of their nine mattresses. Uh, they also have free shipping and returns. They have financing available. So if you're worried about you know, making one big lump sum payment, you can actually make monthly payments that are smaller, which is great. Uh, you have a 10 year warranty and a 100 night sleep trial as well. So to wrap up, I think the Helix can be a pretty good fit for pretty much anyone. So they've done a very good job of addressing all the different types of possible sleepers and have a mattress available for those types of people. So if you're a big person, there's a mattress for that. If you want extra pressure relief, they can do that. If you want something that's a little bit firmer, they can do that as well. So they've done a very good job of addressing really any type of sleeper and any type of preference that you might have. So that's basically it. If you're just getting started with your research, definitely check out mattressclarity.com. If you want to see a list of our top picks, simply Google Mattress Clarity plus Best Mattress. And once again, let me know if you have any questions. Questions.